Hi! Hi folks. For the most part, the American news media leans to the left of the political spectrum. However, there's just been one outlet which we look forward to being either in the middle or somewhat to the right, a conservative outlet, and that was Fox News at one time. But recently, Fox News has been creeping its way to the left. A good illustration of that is what had happened recently on Fox News with the host Sandra Smith. And she was, well, inter interviewing, I should say, debating with a congressman from Alabama, Mo Brooks. And she said in part this. And that has been looked at and fact-checked by multiple outlets, including Reuters, who have debunked that as any sort of proof that there was widespread voter fraud. I'm sorry. I yeah, that's what Mrs. Brooks Brooks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that is what Mrs. Smith said, that there was no widespread fraud. And you want to know something, folks? She was correct. There was no widespread fraud, voter fraud t that happened in the 2020 election. But when she was right saying that, she was only right because there was no widespread fraud, but she was covering up for the fraud that did take place. And the fraud that did take place was in what we call the swing states, the battleground states, just a few states. There was widespread voter fraud, and though, well, I shouldn't say it was widespread. And the reason for that is even in those states, voter fraud was not widespread. It was strategic. It was microscopic in certain precincts. Certain precincts in those battleground or swing states, which most likely was in large cities, all you had to do was engage in voter fraud to swing it, the precincts to the Democrats, and you would win the presidential election. And that's what happened. The Democratic Party has been perfecting this strategic attack on our votes for years. And it came to a head, a glorious head for them, in the 2020 election. So when Mrs. Smith says there was no voter fraud, she was correct. But she was covering up the truth. It wasn't right, excuse me. When she said there was no widespread voter fraud, she was correct. But she was covering up for the real voter fraud, which was strategic battleground or swing states. Mo Brooks was correct in correcting her in her error. Hi, right, folks. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. And God bless the nation you happen to be in. See ya. <laughs>